hey there this is Vanessa Deberlay and thank you for coming to my channel today I'm going to answer the question is keywords everywhere free we're going to answer that question but along with that I'm going to tell you what it is and what it does and how it may help you in your business and then three I'm going to kind of show you how to work out the answer to my question and how it's different than most other tools and the way they set up their offers okay so we're going to go through that and what I'm not going to do I'm not going to try to sell you anything today wow isn't that cool um, no affiliate link or anything like that I, this is just a tool that I use in my business and I had that question and I went and researched it so now I'm going to give it to you I'm going to answer that question for you actually you can go to keywords everywhere and it is an seo search engine optimization tool it helps you find keywords so if you're in any kind of a business and you're promoting your brick and mortar business online or you're promoting an online business you probably are familiar with keyword search that's that helps you find out what are people looking for and this is the, the home page for keywords everywhere and it has changed a little bit um it used to be where they just had a great big page and it said download this chrome extension and you did and you got to use it well now you see this little pricing tab and i'm going to go ahead and hit that and if you've never used it before maybe this will turn you away because you were told in some old videos that this is a free program and it was free for a very long time but what they do is they don't have you pay a monthly fee which is kind of cool you pay for credits now I knew that they had made this change probably it's been a couple months if not three or four months ago it's been a while and I just went off and tried to find something else for free because I didn't want to pay this and I wasn't really sure how that worked because if you know anything about keywords everywhere and their search they bring up a ton of different options and I'm thinking well they're probably going to you know knock that 10 bucks out really fast in one day so I kind of just steered away I made my own assumptions and I did not look into it and today I was watching a video actually this morning and they were talking about how keywords everywhere is free and I'm like no it's not update your video well they can't but um then I thought well let me go check it out again how does that work and this is what I found out I'm going to answer that question first um how to use this and how to figure it out and then I'll go into what it does so those of you that already know what it does watch this part if you already know what it does and all that stuff then you can go ahead and leave after this I won't keep you <laughs> your time is valuable so let me explain this part first because this is what my title was but what you do is you go in and you purchase credits now before you are able to purchase credits you have to download the the um, Chrome extension so you would just go in um, in here and get an API key and or even just hit buy now and it'll walk you through it that's what I did I went right here to this page I hit buy now and I already had it um, loaded so I didn't have to do that part but then it brought me through the steps that I needed to do so it'll do that for you and what a Chrome extension is is you go um, if you go in the top of your um, on Chrome at the top their extensions are like real shortcuts let's call it that and you usually have a little let me pull this nah, I don't know how to show it to you let me pull this down look at my top right up here see that that's I have vidIQ there if I hit this these are my extensions that are open right now and there's the um, keywords everywhere it's a K with black around it a red K so that shows you what it looks like and you will install that and you can install it on your Firefox and on your Chrome now how do these things work like how do these little credits work well let's go ahead and I did a search and I just searched what is the best coffee I just try to find something general and what it does it tells you um, how many people are searching for this every five seconds there's over four billion people searching and trying to get that question answered now can you believe that and then up here it's going to show you about how many people um what the um, cost per click is it's about a dollar and what the competition is not very high it's got you know pretty low competition now over here let's say that you're into affiliate marketing and your website is all about products and that's what you're promoting um household household products or maybe you're doing a cooking show and so you can justify looking up coffee and things like that because that's something you're going to um, explore on your show and within your niche so over here on the right this is what I was worried about I was worried that every time I search for something they always give you related keywords and other things people search for well every single one of these 
entries would be one of my credits. And I'm thinking, man, you could use those up really fast. Well, this is why I suggest that you'd use it because it doesn't do that. See right here? If I want to find out the, the metrics on any of these, I just hit this load metrics and it tells me if you load this, you're going to use eight of your metrics. Now, if this is something important to you and you want those things, then go ahead and click it. And same thing down here, there's 23 or uh, 45 more credits. Again, if you really want to dig in and do some research and you need the information, then click it. But what I love about it is you don't have to click it. So as of this search, I've only used one credit. Now I started thinking, sometimes I'm searching for things for personal reasons and not for my business. Like I might want to know what the best coffee is because I don't like the coffee I'm drinking. And anybody that knows me don't share what I drink because nobody likes my coffee. It's Maxwell House. Um, they call it old lady coffee. So I guess that fits the mold, right? But anyway, we did move it up. We're up to the medium now, not the light. But um, if I was looking for something else, it is going to use my credit. So you're probably thinking, well, I search for stuff for the kids and for projects and all this stuff, and it's going to use up my money. What you need to do is let's go back up here to where I showed you, um, hit that little three dots in the top right hand corner, hit your icon, the K, and uh, it should pop up there. That's my data on keywords everywhere right here this is what i have left in credits i just bought it this morning so i've used seven if i want to look up things personal for personal purposes and i don't need all that turn it off and then when you're doing some research you're going to have to remember to turn it back on for your business but that's how you don't use up all of your credits um, if you forget to turn it off and your kids are using your computer and they're searching for things and your spouse everybody's searching for things on the computer that hundred thousand will go pretty fast so make sure you turn it on and off now what if you were searching for something for your business let's do another search how can i make money online and as you can see five uh, <laughs> billion people are searching for this but it's really huge if i were to make a video about this in my business i probably would get lost on page 3459 i mean it's just unbelievable so keywords everywhere is going to help me narrow that down and it gives me this information yeah people are looking for how to make money online but what's a different way that they're asking now i could hit this over here and use up my eight credits and find out let's do it i'm going to do it for the sake of this video just to show you what happens but see i get more data on every single one of those and i can see the cost per click and look it gets pretty high how to make money online with google that's four dollars um, but the search volume is is lower and that's what i i always try to get something uh, two thousand or less as far as the volume but notice the lower your volume the more the cost per click is going to go up and the competition all the way up and down it's it's fairly um pretty pretty much the same it just depends on what you're doing with it are you putting a blog on your website are you making a youtube video how are you promoting this and is is that information important but the point there is um, i could also instead of clicking that and using up eight of my credits i could have just typed in how to make money online for beginners and there you go i already typed it in and again i don't have to use up the related keywords on the side i can go in and pick and choose which ones that i want so hopefully that was helpful for you to see that was my fear i thought oh my gosh those hundred thousand credits is going to go fast for ten dollars um just block out the time that you want to do your research and turn that little um, icon that little chrome extension on and off and like i said it's very easy go up there where the three dots are top right hand corner click that i know that has a name but i can't remember what it's called hit the little chrome extension it's a black circle with a red k and then you can just turn it off and i'm going to do that right now show you how to do that again and it just pops up and it gives you all your information and the cool thing is it tells you how many you have left now see it just went down because i used those eight but i can import keywords i can um, analyze the page um, all kinds of different things that i can do i didn't want to get into too much detail about what keywords everywhere does as much as answer your question is it free it's not free anymore but i think 
I really like the way that they're having you pay instead of paying a recurring monthly fee because you know and I know there's times that we have tools and we get all excited like just like you do with your toys you're going to play with them and then well kids with their toys but you play with it and then you put it aside and then you come back to it so this way you're not paying every month you're only paying for what you use and I, I really like that that the way that they have it set up but they'll take you through they'll uh, connect you to your email list and um, have you pay through PayPal or charge card. So it was very, very, very easy to follow the steps. So before you leave, just make sure you give me some comments. Are you using keywords everywhere? And give us some tips. What are you doing with it? What do you like about the feature? What do you not like about the feature? Tell us in the comments. We'd be happy to um, hear that information from you because none of us are experts in everything and we all have something to um, give to each other to help each other out and before you go make sure you put give me a thumbs up if you like the video and subscribe to my channel and I will see you on the next video thanks for watching